a large group of election deniers will refuse to certify the election this year is the latest rumor that's going around. It's coming from a report from Rolling Stone and then leader Rachel Maddow talking about how 70 election deniers will be serving as election officials in swing states and might be plotting to not certify the results in their counties. You also probably saw Trump say this. You got to get out there and you got to watch those voters. You don't have to vote. Don't worry about voting. The voting, we got plenty of votes. This has caused a lot of panic. Does this mean there will be a wave of Trump loyalists who refuse to certify the election should Kamala Harris win in November? Is he so not worried about the votes because he knows his League of Minions and very important roles have his back? No, but it's hopefully not going to be as bad as it sounds. The thing is, it's been happening. Election lawyer Mike Elias writes how Republicans have increasingly wanted to control the election process and how aggressive they've become. But as he points out, those that challenge election results are quickly brought to court. This happened a bunch in 2020 when Trump himself was found to be calling districts, encouraging them to not certify the election. So are we f No, we just know their game and we have to be prepared, even if that means going to court.